In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Google Tasks. So as its name suggests, it's a task manager by Google, which you can use on your laptop or on your phone. So I've given the timestamps for both in the description and you can check it out. So on the laptop, Google Tasks doesn't have its own website or app. Instead, it's integrated with all other Google websites like Gmail, Google Calendar, etc. So now I'll show you how to use it. The first thing you have to do is go to your browser and make sure you've signed in with your Gmail account. So you'll find that on the top right over here. So now I'm on Gmail and to get Google Tasks, I have to click on this arrow over here and this will show me the side panel. And as you can see, Google Tasks has come here. So now just click on it. So on any Google website, you can access it like this. So now I'll show you how to create a task. To do this, click on add a task. Then you'll have to enter the title over here. After that, you can add details, which is like a description. And then to enter the date and time, just select this over here. And then you can decide if you want this task to repeat. So if you want it to, just select repeat. And here you can decide how often you want it to repeat. So I can decide once every week. So I can change the frequency from here. So I can pick once every day or week or month. And then you can just fill in this info the same way and click on OK. And here as you can see, the task is created. So the same way, if you want to add more, you can click on add a task and follow the same method. So one thing I like about Google Tasks is that they've kept the design extremely simple, but you can still do what you need to, that is creating tasks and easily accessing them. Since the tasks added over here are linked to my Google account, I'll find them on any other Google website. So if I just go to Google Calendar, then if I go to Tasks, as you can see, both my tasks have come over here. So this is how to add tasks. And if you want to complete them, just click on the circle over here. Now the next thing you can do is create a list. So in this, you can keep all tasks related to one category in the same list. I'll show you how to create it. So just click on my tasks that's written over here. And then click on create new list. So let's say I want to keep one list for home. So I can call it home. And then if I want to create one for work, I can again click on this arrow on top, click on create new list and just type in work. So now as you can see, I have three lists over here. One is for tasks, one home and one work related. And the same way as earlier, you can create tasks in each list. Now I'll quickly show you some settings related to the tasks. So if you click on the three dots next to it, over here, you'll find a few options. So the first one is creating a sub stack. So basically, I can add many tasks under one. So under finish work, if I have three things to add, then I can just add three sub stacks under it. After that, I can change the list to home or work by just clicking on it over here. And the last two things you can do is delete a list and start it. So to delete it, just click on the three dots and click on delete. And to star one, just click on the star icon over here. So this is basically how to use Google tasks on your laptop. And now let's move to our phone. Now on the phone, you'll have to go to the play store or app store and install Google tasks, which looks like this. And then just open it. After that, sign in with your Google account, which you'll find on the top right. And as you can see, the same tasks and lists which I added earlier have come on my phone now. So now I'll quickly show you how to create a task and list on your phone. So to create a task, just click on the plus button, which is at the bottom. And it's the same process. So first, just enter the title. Then the first button on the left is to add a description. After that, the next option is to decide the date and time. So click on it. And here, just select the date and time. And if you want it to repeat, just click on repeat. 
And the same way, you can decide if you wanted to repeat every week, day, month, all these options are over here. And then just click on save to add the task. So this is how to add tasks. And to create a list, it's extremely simple. On top, just swipe to the right. And then there's an option called new list. So just select that. And here you can enter the name of the list. And then just click on done. But there's one additional feature on the phone and that's creating a widget for Google tasks. So to do this, go to your home screen, then long press and click on widgets. After that, just go to Google tasks. And here, as you can see, they have this widget. Then you can resize this widget. And now it's extremely convenient. So if you want to add new tasks, you can click on the plus button over here and just add them from here. And if you're done with tasks, you can complete them by clicking on the circles over here. So this is how it works on the phone. And if you want to know how to set a time limit for apps on your phone, then check out this video over here. That's it for today. Goodbye.